my name is Darius Kavavehi. Uh, I was born and raised on Oahu, a small little island in Hawaii in the Pacific Ocean. From the time when I was born up until I was four years old, I was emotionally, mentally, physically, and sexually abused by my parents. I lived in my first foster home for a few years and met with a lot of verbal and physical abuse by my foster parents in that home. I was about nine or 10 years old, entering about my third elementary school. This is my fourth foster home. And I went through a lot of mental depression, ended up wanting to take my life several times. There was a pretty big shift in fifth grade where I kind of learned to just start taking life back in my own hands. I ended up moving in sixth grade to live in what would be my final home. I eventually got adopted in seventh grade and during high school, made the decision to join the military got a Navy ROTC scholarship to study mechanical engineering at Purdue University. Graduated commission from college and been in the Navy for about six years. It depends on the family. I have friends that have been adopted into homes that still cause a lot of trauma and, and uh, turmoil in, in that child's lives. It can really depend on, on the family. You know, adoption's not the end all be all. There's still a need to, to validate and, and ensure that the families that are, you know, adopting children are actually good homes uh, that that should be taking kids in. Adoption's not where the journey ends, right? That's that's step one of the process of healing of, of everything that kind of happened. And that's kind of how I foresaw this when I was growing up as well. So that was such a monumentous occasion. Like I specifically remember, you know, August 13th was, was when I got adopted. From there, that I could eventually actually really delve into the healing process. I started coming to terms and accepting, you know, kind of everything that happened beforehand leading up to it because I was forcibly taken away to get placed somewhere else. I felt like a hole was uh, missing uh, within me. and. and you know, the stability that I once had came back and I got adopted and, you know, that that's what truly allowed me to kind of just uh, be become myself, right? And, and feel that I have a reliable family that I know no matter what happens, uh, no matter what I go through, I can always rely on, on my family. Adoption is like the first step in the direction of the rest of our lives. And so that's, that's kind of how I view it. So it, it was a great, moment to feel that I actually belong and I can actually be part of a family, but that's just part of a, a much larger process of, of healing and kind of coming to terms of who we are and, and, and everything.